in a world where peace once reigned. An insidious infection has turned everything into chaos. The undead now roam freely, consuming everything in their path. You must kill them and clean the world from the infection. Engage in epic battles against relentless hordes. Join alliances and strategize with friends. Build and protect your city from threats and unlock powerful heroes. Age of Origins. Hey guys, welcome back. You know I love making crazy videos, especially about zombies, gathering, production, pretty much everything in Age of Origins. In today's video, I'm going to show you how much XP I earned after saving up over 500 fuel. I waited patiently for one of the big events so I could use it all, well, once. And as you can see from my monster reports, I've been saving up a ton. I've killed so many zombies that it feels like it's never ending. Seriously, there's a lot. This is all from today. Now, let me show you how much XP I got and how it affected my ranking. I saved all ice fuel for the special themed event to maximize my rewards and guess what? It pushed me to rank 1 in my entire state. Yes, that's right, I'm now ranked 1 in my nation in terms of commander level and I'm not even a whale. The reason I chose to save my fuel for the themed event is that it gives me special items which boost the amount of XP I earn. And let me tell you, the XP from this event is insane. You can find the event items here, and they give you an extra crazy amount of XP. So, what happened? After killing around 1000 zombies, or maybe even more, I wanted to know exactly how much officer XP I would get. As you can see, I'm now at 2500 out of 3000 in the event progress. I've only been playing for about a month, and this means I've been killing around 100 zombies per day. Anyway, let's check out the recruitment rewards. For recruitment, I got a huge amount of blue recruitment items, which are going to help me a lot. And for the officer XP, let's see, okay, see how much I got. 700? Um, I got a thousand from this. 25 from this? I think how much experience that 32, 35, and 36, almost 37. Oh my god, look how much I'm going to add any in here. Okay, so 4.5, 4.5, 7 at advanced research me. It's not really much, but how much XP is that to know? Okay, so this is the level 1, and that's purple. Let's see how much XP it's going to be if I decided to take it from 1 to 32. My god, that's not bad at all. Absolutely, I'm getting 32 XP. That's how many officer XP I managed to cut. But of course, guys, don't be dumb and use this all in one. Like, for example, yeah, you can take this into 32. But at the same time, if I choose to put them up to level, 25 as an example like 25 it's not going to cost as much like look like this see it's 25 i'm able to do that with two heroes which would allow me to get even more like increased put put construction and if i want to go low proper for example i could upgrade all my heroes to level 18 it wouldn't cost much and if i split this between all my heroes I could just add this and go into war here, so maybe I'd make all of them level 17. See that? Or maybe just add hundreds like this. You have to split all your XP, all your, your officers. But a game and it's a game of patience, you are going to win eventually. But I didn't even use my recruitments, which I got from you. And I didn't check how many resources I got. Let me check. Okay, 12,000 foot crates, 
14,000 oil, 18,000 steel, and 9,000 minerals. My God, what about the crafting materials here in the storage? I didn't pay attention to it. My God. So, I don't think I'm getting blue. I only get the regular. This is the rare. The rare series circle port is rare. And 75, 58. Oh my God. They're all 80, 80, 90. 80 holy crap there's like 181 from this one okay not bad really really not bad so i can use these to push into the next level easily uh, okay so that's it for the resources and the materials now put miss recruit the free recruitments i got from this okay extraordinarians maybe this guy would upgrade okay. garbage I'm not going to get any purple hero here. Ah, nothing good. Ready. I don't like any of these. Just a single freaking purple? What the fuck? Not good, my god. That was a disappointment. Let us try. Maybe I'm locking here. Okay, maybe I'm locking here. But again, I didn't really expect much better results and this is really garbage. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this, but I wanted to give you one more piece of advice before you attempt to save or use your fuel. You need to go into the strategy heroes and put the XP as I had XP which is how I managed to get a crazy amount of levels for this one. Like literally a crazy amount there's that one and i think i had another oh yes and here these five percent bonuses literally add up and from the equipment itself you craft the equipment that adds xp which is uh i forgot the name but anyway it's one of the equipments all right guys that wraps up today's video as you can see, saving up your fuel and being strategic with events can really pay off in Age of Origins. I managed to kill over 1000 zombies, racked up tons of XP, and shot to rank 1 in my state, all without being a whale. Thanks for watching and if you found this video helpful or just enjoyed the madness, be sure to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on more Age of Origins action.